Hey Sagittarius, Happy New Year. Hope you guys are doing good. So let's just get, let's get this reading started. Remember the roles can be reversed. I could be talking to Sagittarius, a cross, a cross watcher, or a third party, okay? What is the overall energy between Sagittarius and their person? What is the overall energy between Sagittarius and their person? High Priestess. What is the overall energy between the Secretaries and the person? Wait a minute. Three of them are there. I didn't even notice. Two. High Priestess could be good. More Cancer. That's because I said cancer right now. Sorry, Sagittarius. What is overall energy piece between Sagittarius and their person? Maybe it is a cancer you're dealing with, even though that is a cancer. Who knows? What is the overall energy piece between Sagittarius and their person? In the signs. Mm. Okay, hold on. Okay, so Sagittarius. I see the sun here, which is a beautiful card. It's about happiness. It's about um fun, positivity, warmth, success, everything together. It's a beautiful card. It's like one of the most beautiful cards. In the decks. You come out as a high priestess. I feel like the person you're with or the person that you are manifesting with the cup here and you coming as a, as a high priest, it's good. Okay? It's a good energy. It's a good vibe. You guys are happy. You guys are stable. You guys are manifesting good things. And if you haven't um, had this person, this person is coming in. Okay? And you are like the highest priestess now, right, right now. I feel like you're meditating a lot, Sagittarius, for some reason or the other. I'm picking up like, like you're meditating. Like you're sitting down and meditating a lot with your thoughts. Um... Meditating, maybe because you have a little bit of anxiety. Maybe listening to meditation music or even just meditating on your own. Closing your eyes and meditating. For some reason, I'm picking that up. Um, it has nothing to do with your relationship. It's just you are just meditating and taking some time for yourself when you can. And I feel like you sit in a backyard or something. Um where it's dark and you have your own little space there and you might meditate in that area. That's what I'm picking up. Um, I, I believe... 
you or someone might have seen a shooting star for some reason they're telling me that so if that resonates to anybody let me know in the comments i feel like someone's seen a shooting star or maybe just like named a star or just wishes upon a star or something for some reason sagittarius i feel that hold on Give me. Yeah, my daughter came into the room for some dinner drink. Give me a second. Yeah, I've been drinking nothing all day. I'm sorry. A girl got a drink. You feel me? And the dogs got a park. <laughs> um. So I feel like whatever you're going right now, whoever you're with right now, Sagittarius is going good. You guys are happy. You guys are stable. You guys are having fun together. You guys are doing things together, spontaneous things together. You guys are balancing your relationship out in a very good way. If you guys um, are not with somebody right now, a person might be coming in and this is what's going to be happening uh, with your new person. But overall, you guys are doing really good. Um, this person's going to bring a lot of balance to your life. Sagittarius, whoever you're with. They're going to make you happier than what you are right now. If this is not manifesting right now, it's going to manifest. This person's going to make you very happy. Very happy, Sagittarius. You're going to have a lot of fun with this person. They're going to bring balance to your life for some reason. There's some imbalance in your life, and they're gonna they're gonna bring balance to your life, okay? So whatever struggle you're going through right now, this person is gonna help you with that. Is what I'm picking up. Hold on. Wow, the cards are like, the reading is good. They don't want to jump out. Hold on. I feel like this person is catching like some type of feelings, like maybe falling in love. You could be dealing with a Virgo, Sagittarius, with the six of them coins. The page of coins. A lot of coins been coming out today. Hmm. An offer of something is coming to you. Sagittarius. That's also um Virgo energy. You might be dealing with a Virgo. Came out twice. Okay, Virgo and Virgo. Like this person's gonna bring balance into your life. This person is going to bring happiness to your, li to your life. That happens so every once in a while. Here. Um, look at the cup right here. Like this person is offering you a cup. I don't know if you can see it. Um, you might get an offer... Of money is what I'm picking up here a new job and here it comes again the king of coins the coins are coming out a lot today maybe because it's the new year hey I mean if, if this is gonna be the new year was that's what's up I mean, I have the news on right now, which I never do, and it's, there's a lunatic, this, I mean, it's going crazy out here in the capital. It's like crazy what's happening, and we just started the year. I feel like, um, your person, or you, might be into Wicca, maybe, or believe in, um, Wicca. It doesn't mean anything. It's just 
Well, they just whispered in my ear. That's a good thing. I mean, if you do, more power to you. I'm a witch, so. Just do, do good things. Don't do bad things with it, okay? I'm, I mean, it's not coming out nothing. I'm just giving you advice. Okay, so. This person might be offering you something. Like, I don't know. Maybe somebody here lives, like, in a place that has acres or something like that. Or you might be, like, moving to a place that has acres. Like a farmland or something. Where you could have your own animals and horses and things like that. A house with acres like that is what I'm picking up. Or you already live there. Or this person lives there is what I'm picking up. Okay. You are Sagittarius, the Ten of Wands. You're being patient with this relationship. Okay, and you're balancing as well. You might be the one that's balancing this relationship, but you're being patient with this person. You're taking it slow. And that's a good thing. You have a lot of patience, is what I'm picking up. For the Sagittarius that's going to resonate to this. I feel like whatever happened in the past, you had a lot of patience, maybe. And that didn't end up well. So in this relationship, or whoever um, you're talking to, you're having patience with, so you don't make another mistake. And that's a good thing, Sagittarius. For you to do, okay. The three of wands. You could be traveling. Is what I'm picking up. You could be traveling. Somebody lives by the water. I don't know if you know somebody that lives by the water or um sees the sunset and hears water, maybe at night music, a night of water. Libra energy, the justice come in here. Maybe some justice has been served in the past because of this Ten of Wands that came out. Maybe some justice was served in the past. And this is why you're taking it, you know, um, kind of slow, you know, and patient with this person because you've had so many, so much patient in your past relationships. And it's been kind of like hectic in your other relationships and it didn't go well so you're learning to have patience okay and this is good because i see this relationship whatever you're manifesting or whoever is in this relationship it's going to be it's good okay so it's a good reading i mean what else can i tell you you could be dealing also with a oh um the high priestess you came out as a high priest you could be dealing with a pisces as well i'm saying the signs today i don't know why well, yeah, I'm saying this nice today. You know, you're ready to take the leap of faith, okay? With that high priestess energy. You're ready to take the leap of faith. What does um, Sagittarius' this person want to tell Sagittarius? What is um, Sagittarius person? What is Sagittarius, please? There could be a lot of anxiety, a lot of um, you be you could be going through a lot of anxiety, Sagittarius and depression. Um. Be careful with that, okay? Just take it slow like you're doing right now because I see anxiety and depression. The palace of coins. I mean, this is what your person is telling you. A warm house. A warm house. Stability. Union. Happiness. 
a home okay that's what your person wants to tell you and again like I see a farm with animals beautiful garden you guys might just be moving out of the somewhere hold on what else is um said it um Sagittarius person want to tell Sagittarius, please. Wow. What else do you want? The sun card. Come on. And it's going to go fast. Right there you, you go. I'm not going to get these two. Because this is like the past. Like this that came out could have been a tower moment that this person had in the, in the past or maybe you both had a tower moment in the past and you just came back together. And with the death card, the death card is not a bad card. It's change. Okay? And there is good luck there. So you might have had a tower moment at some point. Maybe you know this person from the past and you just got back together. Or it's a, it's a brand new person. And they had a tower moment. And you make them happy. Okay. Oh my God. Everything lit up. Wow. Wait a minute. What is... Everything lit up. Okay. This happens every once in a while. You know. It's not freaky to me. But sometimes it freaks you out. You know. Yeah. So this person. Like. This is moving fast. Whatever is happening here, if you're with this person or this person is about to come into your life or you're about to meet somebody, this is going to go fast. It's going to be beautiful. Look at the sun card. Happiness, warmth, joy, stability. I mean, what else more do you want? A home, warmth, family. Like, it's beautiful. Balance. This person is going to help you balance whatever struggles you have the sun card i mean it's a beautiful reading i mean i've been getting a lot of beautiful readings today this is oh this one just popped out i didn't grab it just flew two of them flew this is a beautiful reading sagittarius like i'm happy for you okay um and for those that don't have anybody right now this if somebody's coming in this is gonna happen maybe that tarot moment that came out where is it Right here. Maybe the tower moment that came out with this death card. Maybe it's someone that's dealing with Sagittarius that is went through a tower moment and something good is going to come out of it. Okay? With a death card next to it. Something good is going to come out. Okay? So let me read you these. It says, do more research before proceeding. Education in the form of... A Seminars, going back to school or, wait a minute, I can't see nothing. Apprenticeships, excellent craftsmanship and long-term projects. So if you're planning to go back to school or you want to go back to school, it doesn't matter what age you are, do it and good things are going to happen for you. Okay, so falling in love suddenly, being swept off your feel. They need to stay grounded during a very emotional experience. So, there you go. Let me get you an oracle love card for you and your person. Whoever it is getting swept off their feet or got swept off their feet, I love it. I feel like somebody here likes to whisper in the ear naughty things. I mean, who doesn't? But this person is like... They like to do it a lot. And I think it's a female, not the male. It says, imagine all unwanted thoughts dissolving into light, creating room for new opportunities and possibilities for your life. You see, that's the message, okay? Beautiful reading. I wish you the best of luck, Sagittarius. I hope this helps you, and I'll see you next time.